in the fucking yeah. way. There's no place to hide once I step inside the room. Dr. Jones, prepare for the boom. Hey guys, welcome back to That Duder Gaming. Back after my wonderful vacation to Bermuda. I'm not going to bother y'all with my pictures and everything. May make y'all a little jealous. May not. I don't know. If y'all want to see pictures, give me a comment in the comment section below. And on the next video, I will let y'all see a couple of pictures of Bermuda. Um, the sands were supposed to be pink. Um, they were not as pink as everybody said they were. So that was kind of a letdown. But, you know, it is what it is. But it was absolutely beautiful. I also stayed a couple of weeks in, I mean, not a weeks, but days, a couple of days in New York after the Bermuda trip. And it was absolutely awesome. But I am back and we are on my main account. I have to give a huge shout out to my boy Tony Steams on my main accounts team and huge shout out to Matt Bowlers who is handling my two teams on my my two alts for the uh, Cincinnati team my Houston team and then my last shout out to Vladdy Dingers uh, uh, who was handling the uh, the um, Dodgers team um, all of them were hooking me up while I was gone they were handling my teams so, I'm going to let y'all see exactly what they did while I was gone. We are going to play with the teams a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and see what we can do. So, uh, Tony actually on this one, he actually did my league games and everything. So, uh, I actually have quite a bit of inventory and everything from him playing the actual games and everything. I mean... Uh, it's actually really, really cool that he did that. He didn't have to. So, Tony, I uh, much props to you. I appreciate it a bunch. Um, I know uh, Matt had a lot with dealing with two teams. So, he did the club challenge games and the, the club uh, regular games. So, I appreciate it a bunch. Uh, Matt did some... He did some really cool things with the actual accounts. I will see... I will let y'all see that... In just a couple uh, minutes, um, it was really cool. Y'all are gonna have, yeah, it's crazy what y'all are about to see with those. But um, right now, let's get into opening some packs right now for this one. Let's see if we can't get some diamonds. Not off the jump. I was hoping we could get one off the jump. That would have been great. As of right now, just a couple of gold. No diamond yet. Oh, but we do get a prime right in the middle, top, and it is a Marlin, you know, probably going to go with Cliff Floyd. No, it is Ty Jones with horrible skills, a bunch of golds, all this is upgrade material. Why did I just make that super loud? Don't need to. All right. That is another gold for some upgrade material. Oh my goodness. I probably should have done this a little earlier. I'm kind of worn out from the day. Long work day, I tell you what. Oh, there we go. There goes a diamond. And a gold prime. Man, that's two primes. Insane luck. Who we got? It's a cub. Probably a Chris Bryant or somebody like that. And no, Javier Baez. That's a that's a newer prime. Have not seen that one. Pretty decent card. All right, just four more of our premiums. What do we have? We got one more gold. All this upgrade material. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Let's see what else. Do, do, do. All right, a ton of inter intermediate player packs. All right, uh, let's go with the 
four vintage player packs, premium player packs. Let's see if we can't get a legend this way. Nothing up top, nothing up top. We are looking for numbers. We did not get any legend players. Nothing, nada. All right, let's see. Let's go with these ultimate player packs. There we go. We got some diamond, diamond action. Three diamonds. Wow. Ton of luck. Three diamonds out of that pack. None of them Yankees. Of course not. Paul Canerco. All right. One more. All right. Let's see. We got to uh, go ahead and open up these golds. What we got here? No Yankees. They're just not wanting to give me any kind of Yankees. Go ahead and open up these ultimate players, live season ultimate player packs. No diamonds here. Uh, open up two of these diamond packs. One and oh, why didn't I push? Keep using, wasting time. Trying to hurry through. Kurt Suzuki. And then we'll go ahead and use this and pick batter. Who did we get? A 95 in power. Oh, Gary Sanchez. All right. What else we got? We got some live season premium packs. No diamonds there. Nothing special. Seven vintage intermediate packs. Nothing special there. Was hoping for any kind of Ruth cars or anything like that. Just nothing special. Nothing at all. Alright, we'll open up these intermediate packs until I just don't have anything, any kind of space left. Come on, give me some, the best you can get is gold. Just hoping for some gold, I guess, for upgrade material. And that would be full. All right. So, we have done that. What else do we have? Premium skill change. I have some skill change. And I have some skill protection change tickets. Of course, those I uh, definitely want to use on my where am I where are my challenges at? Okay, so and how far are y'all in y'all's event? I I think that's another thing that Tony did for me while I was gone, which is awesome because I'm already at 34 laps completed, already finished. I mean, this is a super easy one to get through, but of course I'm already through it. Um, let's see, collect all that, so, like I said, um, with the skill change, with the green tickets, uh, one of the things that I want to do, I only have four, but the main thing that I want to do when these, these green and blue tickets came up is... I wanted to switch this over and try to get some good skills with this fireballer and then reset or retrain Bettens to see if we can make him a good set. Which one was fireballer? It's the one that deals with velocity. Yeah, it's the one that does well with um with a good old dominant pitcher and I already have him trained 
for finesse. Come on. All right, so we have four chances. Oh, let's cross our fingers because, uh, as you will see on the upcoming video for my Cincinnati team, I did not have the best of luck, but it turns out it, it will turn out okay. But let's go for Bettens. Where is he at? All right, here we go. All right, select one skill in the slot of the player to protect. Change all of the skills. All right, come on. Crossing fingers and hoping. And then we get dominant pitcher. Okay, so. That's actually what we want. And then. We, so actually what I need now is I need blue tickets. Dang it. I actually got a dominant pitcher. I was not expecting to get it that quick. Hmm. Dang it, dang it, dang it. All right, so with the uh, premium skill change tickets, uh, I wanted to change out... Posadas. Because we want to try to get him a legend skill on his backup, backup skills. Because he has been doing good with his other skills. Or actually, no, yes, this is what we want to do. Because he's been doing, he, he has done well with his other skills. All right, let's go ahead and do that. Let's get some premium scotching tickets and do that for Prasada. We want some legend skills. Come on. I think I've easily, easily put at least 14 tickets. Did I walk right past him? Yes, I did. Why didn't y'all? Why didn't y'all yell at me and tell me? Anyways. All right, so. All right, everybody cross their fingers. We got three chances. We need to get a legend skill for Posada. Come on. Legend skill. That is not legend. We shall keep the first one. Come on, legend skill. No, far from it. All right, last chance. Last chance. Everybody. I need everybody. Come on. And a big whiff. And we will keep it. Like it is. Okay. Spotlight and Slugger Instinct. I mean, that's not a bad set, but he does well with his other one. So we will keep it. All right. Y'all already know what I must do. I will be right back in two jiggles of a decker of sass. I'll be right back. All right, we are back. And of course, we got 10 more premium packs. Oh, my reserve is. So we are not going to do that. But we are going to do some single change. No, not you, Brett. We're going to do a single change for none other than Bettis. Because we need to take out Thin Ice. Alright, now I really need some crossing of fingers because we really need a good skill for that middle for that middle skill come on cross fingers cross fingers come on no i do not need fixer come on please 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 huh no 
We need something better. Last one. Come on. Please. Oh my god. That is not what I was wanting. Grr. Okay. I will probably have to wait until the end of the month for that skill change. I'm going to put the actual... I'm probably going to go ahead and put the points into him and roll with that kit because that skill is very very good and retrain him or actually I'm gonna switch him back and I'm gonna wait for y'all's comments y'all tell me what y'all think I should do because look at his his other skills untouchable finesse and fight and firefighter I mean, it's a very good set, and he does well with it. Do y'all think that having this or having Fireballer and Dominant Pitcher and that Bronze skill is going to be worth going ahead and doing it, or should I just run with this until the end of the month where we are going to get a guaranteed blue ticket and then and go ahead and... And, and then just wait until that happens or should I go ahead and retrain it and run those skills now or just go ahead and keep him as he is and run him like he is oh man I hate that that, that didn't work out and it almost makes me wish I would have stayed with stability Grrr. all right kind of makes me angry a little bit all right was there anything else in the inventory I don't think there was any skill changes that I needed to make or was there any skill protections that I needed to do to anybody else You know, like I needed to keep one and change the others. No, not him. Not him. I need to change him back. I really wish that I could get a GI for Mickey Mantle. And change him. Dang, I forgot that he needed to be leveled. I need to change him. Need to get his levels. Or need to get tickets for him to level Rizzo up. But he's on the bench. It's not like... I mean, all of those are on the bench. It's not like they get time. Alright. Finesse, last boss. Winning streak. I mean, everybody else seems like they're okay and don't need anything else. Oh, he's horrible. I forgot that his skills were so bad. Okay, so Robertson needs skills completely. Okay, click off of him. Last boss, untouchable. God, I think he needs skills too. Last boss, clean up your mess. He... Alright, so we need to change these skills. Last boss and clean up your mess. He's been... He's been being knocked around too. Probably need to. What is his backup skills? 
why am I not at least attempting to level that and try to run that over this as a relief pitcher what do y'all think should I be running this over this it almost seems logical right and then I think Robertson just needs new skills altogether because inning eater and clean up your mess, that's just horrible. God, he probably needs to be running that better than what he's got also. Man, I think I just haven't been doing anything with it because I just haven't had the, the skill training tickets. Well, I guess I definitely know what I need to be working on for sure. All right, I think that's all I got for my main account. I need to be working on those things. I definitely wanted to show y'all everything and definitely give my props for the guys that handled my accounts while I was gone. I had a great trip. Um, I, now I'm going to go to my uh, my other team, my Cincinnati team, and then I'm going to switch over to my Houston team and and show y'all what my my guy Matt Bowlers did for my other two teams. Let's get at it. All right, guys. So back over to the account. So one thing that I wanted to point out, and I'm going to show y'all the actual my bower now that i've got everything done to him all right so my inside stats my velocity and my fastball are at 14 and the one thing that i thought i could do to actually boost up his stats to try to get him to that 15 point to get him the boost on the dominant pitcher was you could go, I thought I could just go to level 15 and see if I could put him in right here and get him another plus one to his stats. But that's to all stats. Once again, we're running into that problem in which we're adding to all stats and it's not getting us the boost to those specific stats that we're looking for. So, Basically, what you need to do is you need to add to specific stats. So if you run into that problem, basically what we're going to do is whenever that specific pitcher is pitching, the easiest thing to do is to just add gear. Add gear to those specific slots that you need. Like, of course, let's say... Why did I go to lineup? I didn't mean to go to lineup. Let's say you're in your, your league play, and of course you go to condition, and you're playing your match with your pitcher. You need your, I didn't mean to do that, fastball. You need, of course, fastball and velocity. You don't want to put location up. You don't want to put a gold location up versus your silver fastball because you're putting in more location whenever my Bauer is pitching. I want to put in a silver location and a gold fastball because that will give me two more points and that will give me the points I needed for my dominant pitcher bonus. So that's an easy way to manipulate the points. So there, there we got it. We can do that. We can do those little things to activate those bonuses in game all right i don't think we have anything extra that we can do on this no i've got a couple of premium skill change tickets but we've already got like i said matt bullage hooked me up on my bower i don't need to do my premium skill change tickets i did i already show y'all what he looks like i think well I don't think I showed y'all the finishing product, but of course he's dominant pitcher eight. 
Untouchable 4, Slow Starter 6, and stats look pretty nice. I got him Velocity 1st, Location 2nd, Fastball 3rd. I mean, he works, and he does pretty gum good now. Oh, man. So, once again, appreciate you, Matt Bowlers, and... I could head over to the Houston team, but of course, you already know what's going on. Uh, my Wagner is pretty awesome now with his legend skill in Fireballer. Um, do I have enough points? I think I'm just shy. Oh my goodness, 5,980 short 20 points to get my SIG pack. I think I've actually got... Ooh. You know what? I think I have enough to do a combo for a SIG on this team. Combo, combo. I need y'all. No, I think that's my Houston team that I can do that on. I am absolutely certain that that's where that's at. But... To get those extra points on my Bauer, those one point extra, I actually wanted to go into my mentor and change that. I know it's, it seems like a waste of points. I wonder if I'm getting double points from Castillo. Hmm. I wonder. Because Castillo's on there twice. That's a good, that's a good wonder. Suarez, he is getting the plus one from Mentor. Now I wonder if Castillo is getting plus two. No, he's just getting plus one. Even though you have him twice on there. But Bauer's getting plus two. Oh, that's because he's Black Diamond. But Scalfini's getting plus one. He's not even on there. Wait a minute. Where is the where is the plus one from the? That's not right. They are supposed to be getting a plus one from Mentor. All. All stats plus one to players registered on the lineup that match my team. These five players are supposed to be getting an extra an extra plus one, right? Or is it all the players? See, I'm I'm asking a lot of stuff from y'all to be to be saying stuff in the comments. Y'all need to y'all need to help me out on this video. All right, so. We're going to click over to the Houston team because I'm pretty sure I'm almost 100% certain that I have a SIG combo ready over there. So, I'm pretty sure that I don't have a vintage combo over here or anything. Uh, diamond, diamond, gold, gold. Silvers. Nope. I do not. Alright. So, let's go over to my Houston team. Let's get at it. Okay, we are now on the final team. Let's hope that this is the last one. I'm going to show you my Wagner in which Matt Bowlers was the guy who hooked me up on this one let's go ahead and get over to my wagner and of course like i said we ended up with untouchable 345 specialist and fireballer i try to do man i tr I tried to get away from it but seriously it just came back oh it's i wish i could get something else on it maybe at the end of the month when i get my blue ticket maybe i can get that three four five specialist out of there and try to get something a little better but until then that's what i'm stuck with so we um actually do i have any uh, i don't really 
really have anything great to do on this one. Do some uh, 10 premium packs. Nothing great on that. Two golds. And neither of them are Houston. No diamond there either. But the big thing that I was wanting to try and get done on this one and the reason that I wanted to get onto this account was not to go there, but to go here and combine because I do have all kinds of vintages and I do have some SIGs. So let's go ahead and get some vintages out the way. I wanna make sure that I keep a thousand for the SIGs, but let's go ahead and do it. Hey, no, it's not my Cincinnati team. I was about to get excited because I got a gold Cincinnati player, but that's right, we're doing my Houston team. Do I have some prime players in which I can do a prime? I got a Kershaw prime and a Wainwright prime. Yeah, I might have enough to do that too. How much is it for a prime one? Oh well. Kershaw and Mesa. All right. That's no good. Just got to make sure that I'm paying attention to the stars because we do not want to not have enough for the good for the good combo. Oh, we got we got space. I think I think I'm about to we're running out of <laughs> vintages. All right, come on, come on, give me something good. Jay Buner, man, that's that's actually the second gold out of silvers maybe that's a good sign maybe we'll get something good not all right Caldwell I almost don't want to get rid of my David Justin <laughs> that's not gonna do me any good I'm not using him because I don't have a Cleveland team but all right come on Buford no good At one diamond. Do I only have one diamond? One diamond vintage? Yes. Okay, so one sig, two sig, three sig. Oh my goodness. All right. So I'm always iffy on these. I would love, love, I've, I've yet to do a regular SIG. No, no, that's how I got my, um, on my Houston team, that's how I got my, um, my Brigman. So, oh, here goes nothing. All right, crossing fingers. Come on, need a Houston SIG. No, 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 no. I got another freaking diamond sig, but it's not Houston. It's the JJ Putts. I swear he always stays in down condition. <laughs> dang. Dang, gum it. Dang, dang, dang. All right, so we'll do another gold. Oh, and there goes another diamond. Dang. So I did two golds and a diamond, got a diamond. Then I did three golds and got a diamond. It's 
some pretty uh, pretty good look. I don't want to do two diamonds and a gold I'm because I'm sure I won't. Dang. But did I have three golds? I do have three golds. All right, come on, one more, one more. Dang. Dang, dang, dang. I was hoping, I was really, really hoping that I was going to get something. How many miles, what miles do I have now? 3,089. Still so far away. I guess I probably should have saved that for mileage, but then, you know, I couldn't just add it to the video. All right. So that's into there. Da, 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 da. So. That was pretty much it. I just wanted to make sure that I recorded that just in case I got something good. I did not. Boo, boo, boo. Where's my inventory? Don't think I have anything else good. I only have one skill change ticket. So that would not do me any good. Premium skill change. I uh, don't have anybody that I would even remotely want to try to use it on. Because I only have one black diamond on this team. And he already has a legend skill. So yeah. That is it. I definitely wanted to get this video out. It's been almost... It's been at least two weeks since I got back. Like I said, I have, I have, do have pictures. If y'all want to see them, shoot me a comment. Let me know. I will show y'all a couple pictures. But until next time, I appreciate y'all watching. Y'all have a wonderful weekend. Let's get at it. Hey guys, yes, it is back. I'm back. We are doing just a little bit more on the video. I wanted to make sure that I did a little bit of extra innings because when I am deciding to put this out is on Sunday and yes, it is Father's Day. I wanted to make sure that I gave a special shout out to all those fathers out there. Happy Father's Day to all of y'all. But uh, I wanted to do something a little... A little more that I did not do uh, I wanted to see if I could get some of these vintage packs opened up see if we couldn't get anybody I got a Carlton card so I could upgrade my Carlton of course um, then I was gonna do some premium packs see if we can't get some diamond cards so I can upgrade what I am going to be doing in the extra portions part of this video it's just a little extra little something something we are going to i'm trying to do this as quick as possible we got some stuff going on at the house but i told them i was going to break away and try to do this little bit extra on my video because i didn't get to do it as part of my recording last night nothing special oh there we go we got us a diamond what do we got is it anybody special no it is a dodger could care less it's especially since it's a tailor garbo we got two more on the premium packs nothing special there all right, so let's see what else do we have? Oh, we got a premium vintage pack. Nothing special. No numbers at the top. Looks like a Hunley. Yes, it is. Uh, let's see. 
Got some team select packs. Not too worried about it. All gold packs. Got 10 of them. Open up all those. It'll be used for upgrade material, of course. Because I'm telling y'all what I'm about to do. Oh, boom. Ultimate packs. We get us a diamond from the ultimate packs. You know, we've opened plenty of ultimate packs and don't get... It's a little windy. So if you get a little bit of... Uh, wind into the mic i apologize i'm sitting out on the porch let's see here we're going to open up our team pack yankees of course we are going batter i'll try to see if i can't cup the mic a little bit so you only catch my voice an 82 who are we getting uh curtis granderson that's his 2012 year it's his prime year if i'm not mistaken I could be. Crap skills. It's not like I'm going to use them anyway. And so we'll go right into what I'm going to be doing on the video. Let's see. I'm definitely going to be upgrading. I'm going to, let's see here. Da, 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 da. Okay, so I have enough black diamond pieces. I'm going to be definitely, so I actually went into my club. My club members said, I was like, hey, I've got enough black diamond pieces. What should I do? They said, lock up your starting pitchers. So definitely that was what I was gonna do. And the only two pitchers that I have left to upgrade are my Tanaka and my legend um, to do the legend you would need 200 black diamond pieces I do not have 200 I have 165 I believe so I will do Tanaka that's who we are doing so management da 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 da, da. special upgrade black diamond I wish they would have an easier way to do this. The way they have this set up is stupid, where you can only do 10 at a time. I wish they would have, they could do this a lot easier because doing 10 at a time is so time consuming. And when you have to do 160 of them, it could take quite a bit of time, but I guess, I say quite a bit of time, but it's going to take me, what, maybe 45 seconds, maybe? I just got to make sure that I do it. So we're 40 in. We got 160 more. And then, of course, I do have some premium skill change tickets. So we are going to attempt to get him a legend skill. Odds are it's not going to happen. I have six premium skill change tickets. So we are going to cross our fingers. I'm going to need mojo from all of y'all. So hopefully we can get some luck and get though that legend skill that we definitely need on Tanaka. He doesn't have a super good set as is. So he hasn't played up to what he possibly could. So maybe this uh, black diamond making him black diamond is going to be a good thing anyways because he needs a little something anyways so trying to get all of this done like i said i wish they had a faster way to do this doing 10 at a time is uh time consuming and stupid not even gonna lie to you just wish that there was a faster way, but there isn't. All right, so we've only got 40 more, and there is something flying in my face. I wish it would go away. Let's see. Now there's somebody driving by in a motor with a motorcycle. I don't even know if y'all can hear that. All right, so we have. 30 more, 20 more. 
and then we will see these stats go up and then we will try as quick as possible because I know the first part of the video that I recorded I'm not sure I haven't done the the full edit yet to see how long the video actually is so if it's super long I apologize to y'all all right here we go Tanaka fully black diamond boom there we go so not too bad not too bad so let's go back we're gonna switch him over we're gonna try to get some skills on him so see as of right now I had last boss untouchable and winning streak on him and he tends to get knocked around everybody knows it's not the best set to have on him I know I know y'all are gonna kill me in this in the comments so but see this is his backup skill so yeah one or the other so let's go get our premium skill change tickets I have six and we are going to try we need it we need it more than anything right here right now let's go ahead and get our Tanaka with the premium skill change tickets the only way of course that you can get a legend skill we've got six chances let's get at it come on please 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 all right so the first try no good Keep the first skills. Keep trying. We got five more. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we get one and it's Control Master. What sucks is that it's 112. That sucks really badly because I'm going to have five and then I'll have four to go into another one increases location and break so this is the one that would be good with finesse and decreases the opponent's power and contact I mean the thing is is that I may not come across another legend skill. I have to keep this. I mean, we I mean on the second freaking pool, I got a legend skill. I've got I've got to keep this. I actually have some green tickets. We can try to pull finesse. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna keep the legend skill. I mean what what's the freaking odds of that? I mean that is insane so let's go ahead and try we're gonna use these green tickets come on select one skill we're gonna of course select control master and we are going to try like crazy to get finesse come on give me finesse no, I do not need put away pitch. Come on. Give me finesse. One time. One time. No, I do not need giant crusher. We got one last chance. Come on. Come on. One. Oh, no. So we ended up control master, ace, and control artist so that's a location increase ace where all stats increase and control master um this will have to work for now uh the way that he is set up uh, i wonder if i could just roll with him how he is and then just distribute the um, the training points I'm gonna have to roll with him how he is and see if it's going to work man I, hey I'm 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 happy with it how it is
I don't know if y'all just seen that. My battery's running out. All right. Hey, I'm not even going to lie to you. I will take this as a Father's Day present. <laughs> All right. I appreciate y'all hanging out with me on these extra innings. Y'all have a great weekend and a good Father's Day. Let's get at it. Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to fuck with. Don't make the hot ones. I step inside the room. Dr. Jones, prepare for the room.